today tuna dhabihu ya kubariki watoto na sio tu kubariki we are dedicating them the actual word is dedication let me blessing dedication is deeper niwaambia i discovered that wakati kijana moja dedicated the way we are doing today aliingia katika dini ya kiushetani na mnajua kuna hatua wanafuata ile hatua ilikuwa afanyiwe dhabihu ya kuigizwa chini ya bahari hapo ndipo alishagaa bwana asiwe sana alipoambiwa wewe kuja akaenda akaambua wewe tumeambiwa tusipokee we are not receiving you you are already dedicated wapi to the other one we don't talk about Christ. to the other one you are already dedicated to the other one na damu yako ni chungu sana because the bills of kishatani in involve your blood your blood is so bitter we can't receive you and the boy came out na karudi kanisani na testimony akaambia sasa wake nimekataliwa kwa sababu mlinipeana kwa Yesu i declare by the grace of god dedication ya leo hiyo unique kwamba these children hawatapatikana they will not be found live alone mambo mengine from this hour every disease every program of failure every curse every out of darkness will never operate in their lives in jesus name another thing that we do today mahari mtoto mtana we are grow we are declaring two orders kwa sababu wili watoto tunaopokea tunawatangazia madhabahu haya na madhabahu ya family we are establishing two orders shut up baba saya that you rule your son and your daughter the altar of this church na kwa nyumba yako kutakuwa na madhabahu ya damu ya Yesu hallelujah hallelujah we are going to declare the word of prophecy on your son and daughter hataishi maisha ya kugojea tu awe anything hataishi maisha ya kufanyika kile tutanena by the holy ghost maisha ni mwake you know the other day to go to look at pastor titus and i remember arusi yake ndio ilikuwa ya kwanza kufanya hapa na that's why tunaambia wadada wanao leo siku hizi kwa maana your son dad aliza within three weeks wajua nyinyi mnakaa sijui miezi miezi gapi i never preach about four months ni nyinyi wa mama mnaambia hivyo mimi sasa tukubiri hiyo we never said mama akae nyumbani four months labda sisters union <laughs> inategemea 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 unajua watu wanauda kitu unajua mama unaweza kuta huyu amegudua ame nywele aina hii aabukise huyu mwisho what a breakthrough bwana inue sana so what you're saying is this whichever way but we want you to be blessed na inaonekana wewe atakuwa mujilist mujilist mkali sana watu waokoke kwa nguvu eh usijali mama tutamkubusha akiwa mkubwa vile alikuwa analia nataka kunyonya kama unaogopa kumnyonyesha tukiona mama usiogope hiyo kitu hiyo kitu tunaonaka sana wajada kuna watu wataka kutoa hiyo kitu eh hata wewe toa yako toa ni hiyo vitu ma eh pana hapana umiza mtoto mpaka mtoto ukija hapa anaogopa anasema ni kwa ule pasta ambaye anazuia mamia anitolea ile kitu yake eh 
You see now, I remember tukiobea mtoto, God gave me a word. Nikasema, I hear the Lord saying, this will be an intelligent boy. That's all. And I came to discover from Standard One Parker University, haja ikuwa number two. I remembered that Niku process ticket yake ya kwenda France. You know, nikasema Mungu. I pray for you. Kuna neno litafuatwa maishani mwako. Kuna neno litafuatwa maishani mwa huyu. In Jesus name. Hatuwezi obea mtoto awe wa kawaida tena. This anointing cannot allow that. Hatuwezi obea mtoto awe beggar. We can't allow that. These children will be committed to the promise. They shall be the head and not the tail. And we are saying any child to taombea our in a sense and attitude of becoming the head. Na hapo kikapeleka primary. Hapo hapo kaanze kutawala tuwe tungine. Kabila tungine ya kuja hapa. Hey, kuja hapa. Haria hapa. Tutuwe tumediyo na toshibo. Hallelujah. Children who will stand na aseme no to unrighteousness. I declare for shita, but we declare that by the word of God. Kira mtoto wa meshika hapo mundu. To satanism. No to homosexuality. No to pornography. No to all righteousness. I speak the language of no to all evil. Ata bila kuwabua mengi watakuwa na iyo anointing than that consciousness. Naomba ata bila kufikiria they will just say no. Kira mtoto about to ambe with resages to command their parts. Kwa mba kukiwa na wakora pale angel na mambia can you pass through here? Hallelujah. Tuomba wabarikiwe in a way. Any place wataigia. I remember Paul. Paul alipokuwa akeda room. Alikuwa kwa ship. Iyo ship ilipigwa, ikapigwa, ikapigwa. Paul akabia wenzake. Mugu ambaye ninamtumikia. Alinitokea usiku. Akaniambia ataniokoa na nitafika room. Na akasema kwa sababu yagu. How in Guinea water what a kufa. I pray that your boy and that girl will save so many. We will save so many. Aki ingia gari. Na shetani ya mepanga anjari. Bona anamuokoa na anaokoa abri ya wegine. Because your daughter and your son is covered. In Jesus name. Hallelujah. I pray now. Kila mtoto wabatu taanoita kuwambe hapa. Ata kuwa so blessed. Kwa ba muzazi ukienda kutata school fees. Because of this anointing, you will never lack. You will never lack. There will be a mark of favor. Oh, mark of favor. Any time una mushugulikia. Una notice hafa nani na kazi nizake. My God do it now. My God do it now. My God do it now. Biblia haina ubatizo wa watoto. Haina. Iyo tumefudisha kabisha. There is nowhere in the Bible mtoto alibatizo. Hakuna. Ata wakati Yesu alipereko wa tempo. Siku batizo alibatizo wa. He was dedicated. Amen. Na mnajua. We. Samueli. Unajua Samuel. Ure prophet. Samuel was a product. Of the prayer and confession of his mom. And today, Baba yote alia hapa. Na mama, kuna neno utanena. Agaria mdoma huu mtoto. 
Can you declare huu mtoto hata haivuta bangi hata haikunywa pombe hata wahi fanya usharati speak words to that mouth speak words to his sexuality has makataraba bosika mutambilie leo muambi tell god huu mtoto wangu hata olewa na makahata wa makahaba huu mtoto wangu oh my god you can even prophesy to his her, his or her wedding day oh my god it's time to speak words I give God praise kwa sababu Samueli kuna neno mama yake alikuwa amenena akasema baba ukinipa mtoto akimaliza kunyonya nitamuleta akae Samueli alijipata Mungu anaongea na yeye Hakuwa bweni nabii he just found himself becoming what has Mother confessed. I declare today by the authority of God. Every mother, every man, father who is here, your child will become what you have confessed. Your pashata rababosaya. In Jesus name. Amen. Oh my God, my God, we pray that demons you clear away. Whenever your son and daughter steps in, demons you clear away. The favor of your God with that son and daughter. Akiingia anywhere awe kama Joseph chochote Joseph aliwekelea mikono kilibarikiwa mpaka akawa CEO Toomba awe na roho promotion kwamba the spirit of elevation and promotion will force itself in the business life of your child in the name of the Lord Toomba awe na roho ya excellence akipata B analia kama sema am nataka e hata tosheka na mabo madogo atakuwa na roho ya excellence roho ya performance in jesus name in jesus name there's power in the blood of jesus naomba kuanzia leo mungu ameweka a prophetic feeling hajui kuongea lakini awe na a prophetic feeling a prophetic feeling ambao akianza kukua kwa grade 1 itaanza kutokea oh because of prophecy your son and daughter will take a direction a direction kutoka mwanzo hata kosea jia watoto wengi ukosea jia anateseka baadaye your son and daughter will never waste time hata kosea hata kosea kama ni daktari ataanza mapema kama ni pilot hiyo ndio jia atafika mapema kama ni hoteba amen kama ni engineer ataanza hiyo mapema kama ni bishop ataanza mapema kama oh my god hallelujah twasema mugu atuodorea kipindi cha confusion whereby children stay too long Unakuta mtu ako na miaka 30 na hajajua ni nani. It will not be so to our children. May the Lord bless you. Bible nasema katika Mariko 10 aya 13, Yesu alipoletea watoto, aliwaekelea mikono, akawabariki. We are doing that. We are doing that. We know sio tu Bible haisemi ni mikono tu. Inasema he released. He released blessing. We are doing it now by the word of God. Ebto simame sasa we just tell God we need his blessings we need his presence we need his presence Baba tunakushukuru Waminifu wako ni wa milele haki yako ni ajabu mwito wako ni wa kufauru Nimesimama hapa tukiwa na watumishi hao kusema these children are kingdom children their mothers are kingdom mothers their fathers are kingdom fathers their destiny is kingdom destiny mahari wataka bedroom au kitchen or their journeys or their traveling or undertaking it to always be kingdom 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 project they will never be lesser my god and our father watoto hao they will be changers of the world they will change the world they will cause revolutions they will change circumstances they will raise new altars of power altars of anointing in the families 
in the name of the Lord magojo itawapita haitawaingia umaskini utawapita hautawaingia mapigo itawapita haitawaingia ungumu utawapita they will live long life to fulfill the will of God to perfect the word of God in their lives in the name of just Christ nikataka watu wengine waketi wazazi na watoto wasimame wale wazazi wako na watoto wasimame na watoto wao wengine waketi i thank god the house is populated by parents and their children eh karibu tuseme hata wengine mzae au hao wamezaa waongeze of course kairo expect mapacha next time na kina nyambura na kina dongo nimeona sasa wadada hii ilikuwa ya ku ya kusema ya, ku, ya kusema god is able eh si ni kweli now katika imani ya kanisa hili na kwa msaada wa Mungu nyinyi wazazi mlio beba na mkapewa hawa watoto because umepewa you are a pastor of that child you are akia tek you are unabeba mtumishi unabeba je mutakuwa na nyumba ya Kikristo kwa ajili ya watoto wenu kama ni hivyo sema dio sema dio mutawalea hao watoto na msikize vizuri na usikize Utalea huyo mtoto katika ibada na mafundisho ya kanisa utamuinua katika maisha yako ili apate kumjua Kristo kama mwokozi wake Nataka useme hivi Sema e Bwana Mungu unisaidie kulea huu mtoto wangu katika imani ya kanisa hili lako naomba kwa msaada wako unijalie nyumba yangu iwe nyumba ya Kristo kwa ajili ya mtoto huyu naomba Mungu wangu unijalie kumulea huu mtoto katika ibada na mafundisho ya kanisa hili lako naomba Mungu wangu huyu mtoto wangu unipe neema na nguvu zako ili apate kumjua Kristo kama mwokozi wake e Bwana katika jina la Yesu unisaidie 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 take a moment muzazi just tell god lord i surrender my my son i surrender my daughter muko hapa na watoto wako wapeane kwa god i surrender i sataraba kota impona mikasatarabu shererere ma kota riantararaba zaya mikatara mixetenema shererarima koshetanama makatara mashutinima yekosoto riki makanda makatara moshitinima kama katarama bakashatara rababozini mikatara mikashoto rebazaya Haleluya. Nataka ujibu swali nyingine. Je, utajitahidi kuyafanya maisha yako kama mzazi wewe mwenyewe yasiwe kikwazo kwa mtoto wenu? Are you committed kuish maisha bao hamutawahi kwaza huu mtoto katika jia ya baraka? Are you committed? Kama umekuja na your husband or maybe your wife na mnakapa moja muangalie muambie hatutakwaza huu mtoto wetu katika jia ya Bwana hatutamkwaza 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 kama uko peke yako nena neno hilo direct kwa macho mtoto wako muambie 
nimeapa leo sita kukwaza katika jia ya Kristo aliyekuchagulia in Jesus name haya swali lingine je muahidi ya kwamba mtamuombea huyu mtoto kila siku you never lack a prayer for your son and daughter do you commit yourself to pray Munaahidi kwa umoja kama wazazi kuwa na ibada kwa nyumba yenu kwamba huyu mtoto hataona tu ibada ya kanisa hata kwa nyumba atajua kuna ibada are you committed kuwa na ibada kwa nyumba yenu in a way that mnaweza kuwa kila jioni kila asubuhi mna ibada mama anaongoza sifa mzee anahubiri mtoto anaobea mahitaji because you grow up ha ha Je, mnaweka mtoto huyu awe wa Bwana Yesu Kristo. Ili can you hear this? This is serious. Je, mnamweka mtoto huyu awe wa Bwana Yesu Kristo ili afanye naye kama apendavyo kwa kumtumikia. Do you surrender your son and daughter to Jesus so that Jesus can do whatever he wants with him or her? Say my amen. amen. Hallelujah. Katini. Wale wa wale wa tu wengine ambao hamuna mtoto umeleta si mama. Nyinyi wengine. Na uniangalie na usicheke. You are part of this service. One thing we want to do in the church. Kuna watu na msikize kanisani and hear me Seriously. Kuna watu in the church who kwaza watoto. Umeona mtoto wa mtu badala ya kumjenga unamharibu. Anaingia pale kwa gate badala ya kumsikiza ujue shida zake unamkemea. And in churches people have lost children are already given to the church kwa sababu ya wadugu na wadada ambao hawajui kwamba kanisa ni kibilio na ni mpahali pa amani Children want to see love in the church they may not receive it in the estate they may not receive it in the dormitory or in the estate of the street but they must receive it in the church na nyinyi ambao muna ona watoto wachaka kanisani mnawakemea stop it children are not here to be rebuked they are here to receive love of christ kwamba mtoto aweza kosa upendo kwa shure anauliza tutafuga lini nikaone bishop tutafuga lini nikaone asha wa kanisa ninawaamuru kwa nguvu za bwana mtusaidie kulea watoto kuanzia asha kwa geti pale the children know our ashes love them hata kiwa teenager amen bwana asifiwe bwana asifiwe kama kuna kitu nimegudua even teenagers they are looking for love love of a pastor mentorship ya watu wa mungu if they don't get it here they cannot get it at the place of work the other days i was huddling an, a lady Aniambia alienda kuona manager Idaswelia. Apewe kazi. Manager anamchukua, anamweka juu ya mesa amrep. And thank God I was around to rescue her life. Now we had a wonderful wedding of dada. Alikatayo shetani and she is rich. Lazima awe na bahari pa kuja aambiwe waachana na huyo. Come we have way in the kingdom you need to be winners of children winners of teenagers winners of young men i tell you we must win them we cannot lose children na wale wazee mko hapa hii kuguruma guruma yenu waacha bwana hatutaki mugurumo wako we need your love hatutaki kukemea kwako tunahitaji huduma amen Hatutaki hasira yako twataka upako na karama uliopewa ili tujaribu juu chini wakati huu watoto wanawindwa na kuteswa we give them refuge in this church
We give them a place in this church. Hallelujah. What to care? Tamaza giza. Amen. Bwana sasa nikataka jinsi wengine ambao hamna watoto leo inua mikono miwili. Sema hivi, Mungu wangu nitakuwa mwaminifu kwa mwito wangu kama mshirika wa kanisa hili la Apostolic Faith Church kanisa la Kristo ili kwamba watoto hao na, we, we, na wengineo kati yetu waweze kukua katika kumjua na kumpenda Kristo I want you to commit your life for children just tell God use me to give hope to a child give, use me Lord one day to feed a child give hope God give me strength kwamba watoto wa Yesu tukigineko who don't have hope I want they reach out and save children in Jesus name in Jesus name Father we commit ourselves to the ministry of children I know Satan has been looking uh, seeking for them but he will not get them we stand here at the anointing and the resurrection power of Christ saying we have overcome the evil one we are overcomers by the blood of Christ and our children are overcomers. Whatever toto wazazi hapa ambao wameanguka, we claim them from the horrible pit of darkness. Can you believe now you are raising somebody's daughter, somebody's son from horrible pit? Can you believe in your heart? Right now, can you take a moment, take a moment to intercede? Ata kama hujui ni nani? Abia mungu, I stand here as an intercessor. Nina mtowa mtoto wa mutu katika shimo ra uharibifu. Katika udongo wa uteresi. Lord, by faith, I'm raising somebody's son. I'm raising somebody's daughter. From that pit, mahali ya babo anajaripu kutoka na shidwa kwa imani buwana na kwa damu ya yesu. Na umbo nisikie that young man who is a drug addict? That young lady, abana to make a kill shatani. Nina muinoa kutoka kwa shimaro haribifu. Father, save lives of young people. In Christ we pray. Amen. Katini sasa. E buana uninuwe kwa imani nisi mame ni pandemi. The Lord is so kind. We're going to pray for these children by the grace of God.